คาถาเพิ่มทรัพย์ for increasing uh, treasured possessions and wealth treasured treasured possessions might mean your house car gold jewelry or even um, not valuable things that are monetary valuable but uh, something like a, a very rare book that might not be expensive that you always wanted or Things that you consider treasures, and uh, it's often used with m a h a s a n a amulets, especially with the Inku amulet. Yeah, but it's also used with all other kinds of um, Mahalab and Meta m a h a n i u m amulets. Uh, <clears throat> it goes like this. It's a heart mantra invocation, or I call them heart mantras. Some people say mantras, not a kata. Don't want to argue about that. Mantra means mon, mantra means prayer. A kata, kata actually means uh, speech, and so um, a prayer is speech. Anyway, um, some people think it means a magic spell, but everything we say and every curse and blessing in our heart and mind and in our mouths. Uh, emanate vibrations and so have a certain level of power, degree of power to them, depending on the strength of mind, will, and heart. So, the kata p u m s a p goes like this: Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m One more time, slowly. Om Racha Tewa Sawa Hom. Om Tewi Mama Jitang Arahang Sawa Hom. And now I'll do it three times fluently. Om Racha Tewa Sawa Hom. Om Tewi Mama Jitang Arahang Sawa Hom. Om Racha Tewa Sawa Hom. Om Tewi Mama Jitang. Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a c h i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m And that was kata p e r m s a p for increasing wealth and treasured possessions, and can be used with all sorts of mahalab amulets or gambling amulets and amulets for m e t a m a h a n i u m and good business. And attraction charms such as the Inku and m e h o n g p r a i and other kinds of such amulets, and Mahalab amulets like p r a u p a k u d p r a s i v a l i of the Buddhist variety, and so on. Yeah, and you can just use it as a kata as well because it invokes male and female devas and goddesses to come to your mind, and Uh, pays reverence to the arahants, which, uh, if you really mean it, when you chant it and pay reverence to the enlightened ones, and your angels, guardian angels, and uh, share your merits with them, and have that true intention in your heart, then this kata should bring good results. So I'll finish with it one more time, for all of you and for myself. See if I can mean it. So we all have increased wealth. Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m Om r a c h a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g s a w a h o m And I do it again in full version. Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m Om r a c h a t e w a s a w a h o m Om t e w i m a m a j i t a n g Arahang s a w a h o m So the first time was omitting certain sections <clears throat> because it was focused directly on the wish, 
and the second time I did it was also focused directly on the wish for all of you and for myself because I could do with some more wealth um, to reduce mine and other suffering and circumvent problems with so reduce suffering and the second time was the full version so if you notice something missing the first time I said it it was because it was inspirational and spontaneous and with the experience it doesn't really matter because uh, the kata can be adapted to your intentions um, but perhaps I shouldn't have done that because people get confused I should stick with the basic version and let you adapt your own adept versions when you become accustomed to them so may you all have permsap increased wealth with the kata permsap om racha tewa sawa hom om tewi ma majitang arahang sawa hom ajahn spencer for the buddha magic project signing off